Hello, integrals of the Frenchals. It's Dal. Welcome back to my kitchen. And this video is about Sharpedo EX. Now, I said last Friday it was going to be coming. And if you saw the Best Queen video, this is going to be a little bit more funny when, uh, when we get to a certain part. Now, all right, I'm going to show you how this deck works, then give you five servings of awesome awesome matches you definitely had to see the last two we'll get to that now sharpedo ex what does it do first attack is hunt you get to be a bit of a jerk choose whichever pokemon on the bench is weakest and drag it out do 30 damage to it now with a muscle band you can do 50 so really this means you have total control of your opponent's side of the field who's up front who's in the back sharpedo can just control at all which is very very annoying to deal with do i retreat my pokemon do i have enough to retreat oh well, you gotta deal with all that now jagged fang 100 damage and we're like sharpedo this is the era of mega pokemon why don't you do something more cooler and he's like i got this guys watch you get to discard energy from the active pokemon so they have to decide do i attach another energy to it or do i go to plan b and charge up a bench pokemon so now your opponent is in a bit of a trouble now it awesome card you're gonna see how this card works in real fights but first it's partner it's partner in crime is Veltal. you get this for free from the new versus ladder rewards and it's been around it's very strong evil ball this 20 damage plus 20 more damage for any energy attached to Veltal or the active pokemon now that second part is critical because your opponent's like oh if I attach another energy to my active, will this allow Veltal become stronger and knock it out? Well, they have to figure that out. Is there a problem? And why Cyclone does 90 base damage, can't scale higher as a like evil ball. But when the ship is sinking, when Veltal's going down, it's like, hey buddy, you want energy? I got it for you. And you can pass back a double color as a, a dangerous energy because it will count as all energy type. And then the back, uh, Sharpedo's the back line is like, hey, thanks, buddy. I got this, guys. And it comes out and, you know, it's kind of like energy acceleration. Now, the final main ingredient is Hydra Gun. Both EX Pokemons love energy. So this card, attach dark energy from the, this card back onto the active. So for, uh, for Sharpedo's place, it's like, oh, I have this card energy from Jagged Fang. Well, hey, well, Hydra Gun's got the answer. Just pop it back onto Sharpedo. And you're going to see how useful that's going to be. Now, for Velto, scale with Evil Ball. So, more damage it does with more energies. Hydragons could help that out if their energy is in the discard. So, those are the main key attack in Pokemon, sort of. And we're going to talk about the energies. We got Double Colors Energy. It helps Velto, helps out Hydragon. So, easy bit for our understand that. We got double dragon energy is like only one because you know the only guy who can use it is hydra god the other dark pokemon can't even attach it to him hydra god's like ha ha i feel i feel special because so with that you can use double colorless energy crazy headbutt the strongest attack out of the other two without the scaling wise so it's kind of strange that ex pokemon is or non-ex pokemon it's a little bit better than them so those are the energies we have oh dangerous energy one of the newer cards from the Ancient Origin Expansion. It only works on Dark Pokemon. So Dark Pokemon is like, hey, we can't use Dragon Energy, but we can use this. And what does it do? The more dangerous energies attached to it, when an EX Pokemon attacks it, they take 20 damage. And you know, every damage counts and make count towards a, a KO. So it is not a basic energy. It will not work Hydreigon. So that's why I only have two of them instead of uh, the more regular ones so oh, using the regular ones much more than just only two dangerous energies and now what will be help uh, what's the trainer engine what gives you more cards and i have first of all shauna it's just shuffle your hand get five more cards easy we have sycamore this card your hand but you get seven more cards so as long as you play everything that you can that's great he works awesome now i have pokemon fan club which works for an awesome combo play this Grab out Dino, which becomes a Hydra Gun. Then grab out Hoopa. He's a Pokemon, but he's really for his ability. Now, you grab three EX Pokemons of your choice, put them into your hand, and you're gonna grab Veltal. You're gonna grab Sharpedo, and you're gonna grab Shaman. Shaman's like Bianca, or Bianca EX. You just play it down from your hand onto the field, and you get 
drop the six cards. So he pretty much gets you all the Pokemon you need and six more cards. Now, because you can see how that sets up so fast, you could just, uh, the more Pokemon to focus on is Zwilus and as well as Hydra Gun because they're evolution Pokemons. They don't work with the other cards I mentioned. So I'm using Evil Sodas for them. Now I have Ultra Ball. This shrinks my hand. Throw away cards I don't need and helps. Usually I'm trying to fish out Zwilus and Hydra Gun. So that's what mainly they're for. They're also shrinking my hand helps out Bianca EX. Now, other cards, I have the Hex Maniac. They're like, you know, this is really an EX deck. And EX decks are not good against anti-EX decks, which are immune to them. So, Hex Maniac, throw that on. And then Veltal and Sharpedo can just blast right through it. Unless uh, Hydro Gun's active. And it's like, yeah, I got this. You don't need that Hex Maniac. Hex Maniac's like, yeah, be quiet. Now, we have the Verse Seeker. Repeat some of those awesome support cards that I just mentioned. I have Lysander because Lysander just wins games. He pretty much wins every single deck video I do. He does something. He's always there. I have some escape robes because he's got like Lysander and allows me to retreat because these Pokemon have awful retreat cards. This thing has two. This thing has two. I don't really want to pay all, all that. So. Now we have, let's see, I have a Shadow Circle. I only have one because I don't know how many Lightning decks I would run into. Is it popular just meta? Is it not? I'll talk about that at the end. And I have the Skyfield Stadium because Shaman Engine takes a lot of space. Even though it, you get more cards, is you need the extra bench space. So this is why it's there. I have Muscle Band helps all three of my core Pokemon. Just add it on, 20 more damage, very simple. Now, I think I talked about everything, a lot of different cards in this one. So let me get to the matches. I'm just gonna be a little bit ambitious, show you just the quick, simple matches at the start and show you the awesome ones at the end, ending with Vespa Queen and Mega Sceptile. Those matches are gonna be pretty awesome. Maybe not the Vespa Queen one, but you'll see why if you saw Friday's video. Okay, so oh, let's get started. You're still here. Well, how about another serving of chicken and shark? We're gonna start off with Dinosaur as the appetizer. Dino's like, uh, you're gonna get eaten. And we'll put the other Dino in the background. It's quite an important card. And Gengar. Gengar's like, oh, it's a little dinosaur that I can one shot with my Dark Corridor. Mm. And Dino's like, uh, why, I don't really like my job, guys. And he's gonna grab out Lysander. So none of my Pokemon are safe. Okay. But he cannot attack this fern. So my Dinos will be able to survive for a little bit. But what else? TNO, three more cards. So what's gonna back up Gengar? What's gonna back up? Here comes a trainer mail, Birch. Oh, Birch. Don't trust Birch, man. Don't, he'll, he'll get you when you, you know, not expecting it. So let's go ahead and play Pokemon Fan Club. In that case, I'm gonna grab out a Hoopa and another Dino. Yep, we're gonna throw down Dino and Hoopa. Hoopa is gonna grab all the buddy, your buddies out. Oh man, I don't have enough space for a shaman. Well, okay, I'll grab a shaman and I want shark. There's Gengar. No, I want chicken. I want chicken. I want chicken, guys. We're gonna throw out Veltal and I'm gonna go ahead and toss out. Man, this is tough. Let's go ahead and charge up Veltal with an energy. And I'll save. Man, I have to lose Hydreigon, which I don't wanna do that. I'll save this turn just the way it is because there's no other real cards that I really, really want. So, and there we go. The Gengar has got to get a Muscle Band. Is that going to really charge up Dark Knight Attack? I don't think it does. But this is going to be very deadly for my Dinos. Lysander? You're going to Lysander that out? I have a free retreat. So, it's not going to matter too much for me. Dimensional Valley? Ooh! Wait, I have Psychic Weakness. I'm going to definitely retreat. I'm going to definitely going to retreat. And send out Veltil, who will probably one shot this Gengar. Gengar doesn't know what's up. Oh, oh he one shot it due to weakness? Man, that Lysander. Lysander. Lysander, man. What a jerk. What a jerk. So, I've got Shark. I'm gonna throw away this escape rope as well as the Shark and see if I can get a Dino. So, all these dinos, little dinosaurs, are like, uh, we're a little scared. Okay, so if I get double colorless energy, I'm not going to win this match. It's going to be over. That's not double colorless energy, but hey, Dimensional Valley, can't attack. 
I'm not gonna risk it. Let's just put this on. Let's Shauna. I know I have a that and it's like GG. Yep, evil ball, 200 damage, weakness. That Gengar took out. Okay, so that was too quick of a match. We're gonna go on to oh, better one. You're still here. Well, welcome to another server ring up Shark and Chicken. We're gonna start off with Shark. And let's see, I got Skyfield. I got Shaman, this is gonna work well. And I've got the energies I needed. I, I think it's gonna be a good start. So, we'll see what Santa Cow's got. All right. Nope, Shaman, you can't go down yet. I think it's gonna ask me if I want to put down Sh Shaman again, which is gonna be a little bit weird. Nope. Oh, Reggie Ice. Hmm. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna attach Muscle Bag, attach an energy, drop down the stadium, and now that my hand is low, I can refill it back up with Shaman. Six cards, another Sharpedo. Let's just throw it down. And that is it. I'm gonna end my turn. Alrighty. So Reggie Ice, he's like, ha. <laughs> I'm immune to EX Pokemon if I can use Resistance Blizzard and Sharpedo's like, you know what, I'm just gonna pull out that Articuno. And Articuno's gonna put him to sleep. Well, Articuno's like, yeah, come on, pull me out, drag me out, I dare you. So he's gonna charge up this Reggie Eyes. Okay, well, let's go and charge up, uh, give you a Muscle Bands. They are really pumped up now. And let me put another energy on Sharpedo. Evil Soda. There's no nothing to Evo, but... It's lit up, so that's a trick, guys. Don't do it. We're gonna use Hunt. Pull out Articuno, deal 50 damage to it. So now I'm just gonna be flipping these Pokemon unless they put me asleep or paralyze me, which is a nice counter. So now, he's definitely gonna put another energy on uh, Articuno. Put me asleep. Otherwise, I'll drag out Reggie Ice, which is gonna be a little bit weird. Oh, I'll drag out this Meow. So don't wake up, Sharpedo. You, you're so hungry right now, you gotta stay... No, you slept through it. Why? Okay, so... Not gonna have any energies that I really want to use. So, I'll have to end my turn. A bit stuck, but uh, that's just how it goes. So, he is still sleeping. Darn it! But there's no way Articuno can attack next turn, so I think I'm good. Professor's letter got metal. Metal? Why? Okay. Not gonna question that. And another energy on Articuno. Wally is gonna become a Persian. Oh, that's weird. You never see me off do that. So, Persia, what's it gonna do? Fake out, paralysis, ambush. Oh, this is so bad. So, I'm gonna go to sleep while being asleep. Sharpedo, don't sleep. You're. Oh my gosh, you're still asleep. So, you know, I have to shrink my hand in order to use that shaman. Goodbye, Evil Soda. I know you're not gonna work, so let's just toss that out. Let's just give you a double colorless energy. We'll pull shaman because I am in need of cards. I'm in need of cards. There we go. Pokemon Fan Club. Gotta grab out a Dino as well as a... Can't play Hoopa. It's too late for Hoopa now. So grab those two cards. Put out Veltal. Put out Dino. And we're gonna use an Escape Rope. Send out this Sharpedo. Now... No, not yet. He has to retreat. I won't have to deal with the Articuno. And he's gonna send out his Reggie Ice. So I will send out my Sharpedo. This works out. Oh, man. Poke for... Verse Seeker. Alright, I will Verse Seeker for this, and there'll be another Shaman, but we'll see. So, not the greatest momentum start. But we'll pull through. We'll pull through. Okay. So, Reggie Ice. He's gonna heal off his Articuno. Cannot use this Resistance Blizzard, but it can paralyze me. And you know, you better be the good Sharpedo. Don't be paralyzed. Yes, this is the good Sharpedo. Now... I'm gonna go ahead and play Evil Soda. Gonna get my Zwilus out. And hopefully I'll be able to catch up. So now, I know that there's not too many other Pokemons that I'm gonna get that from Pokemon Fan Club. So let's go ahead and reshuffle. Hydreigon next turn. But, let's go ahead and put uh, energy on this and we'll do something annoying. We're gonna use Hunt. And we're gonna hunt this version. Bye. It has one retreat cost. So... He has two Pokemons ready to go, but being in control of the field, he can't really do anything. So, this is good, and hopefully I'll be able to... This is the danger right now, because I'll... No, it's not really dangerous. This guy will be able to manage it, but this thing, I can't hurt it. So, he's going to fully charge that Reggie Ice up. And what am I going to do? 
I'm gonna go this. I'm gonna charge up Hydragon. And let's play an escape rope. I hope he pulls out Reggie Ice. He pulls out Reggie Ice. Bad move. Bad move. Because I'm gonna just send out Sharpedo. Attach this up. And I know I have another Shaman. So let's go ahead and play this. Oh, I don't have another Shaman. I, okay, I didn't have another Shaman, guys. We'll just pull everything except Hoopa. Throw down Dino. Throw down Veltal. And we are going to use Jagged Fang. One shot Reggie Ice. Bad move. And... Take it out before it could even do anything to me. I'll just take a prize card. Oh, this is good for Veltal. This is good. So, with Hydragon out, it's like, why'd you discard energy? I don't know, but I'm gonna give it back to you. So, it's got another energy. Oh, don't be three, three heads. Whew. Only two heads, which is gonna do 100 damage for half my life. But, you know what? I'm on a roll, guys. So, I'm gonna play Shauna. And Shauna's give me a Shadow Circle. You know what? It's time for Shadow Circle. Let's go Shadow Circle, even though it won't help me one bit, but you can't take my Shamans now. And, you know, this is going to be my next Pokemon, guys. We're going to supercharge up Veltal. Uh, do I... I was going to one-shot that. Oh, so, you're still here. Welcome to another serving of Shark and Chicken. Now, my psychic powers tell me it's Tails, so it's going to be Tails. Got it. All right. Now... I hope I start off with a shark and a chicken. And not that. Why? 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 So. Let's see if we can pull pull this out. I still have my Hoopa at least. And I can retreat this. So everything can work out. Combies. Maybe, this, maybe not. Maybe not, guys. So, let's go ahead and throw away Lysander and Mercy. Definitely not the right time to be using those. And I'm going to pull out. It's Combi. It's Combi. Let's get out Sharpedo. Maybe Sharpedo can start hunting these cards down. And you're like, why not pull out, um, tr get everything out of my hand, and we'll use Hoopa. Hoopa still be there. Yes, Hoopa, you're there. So, hand is completely z at zero. We're going to grab out Veltal, Chicken, and uh, Lamb. Yes, I guess I, I grab another Chicken too. Even though I don't need to. So, let's throw these Chickens down. Oh man, undo last action. That's gonna be my last bench space. No, I better save one for a Hydreigon. Ah, yeah, good idea. Now, my hand's completely dead. My hand's completely dead. I need a Sky Field in order to do anything at all. I still have an escape rope, so hopefully I will be able to grab an energy. Oh, why is it sitting there? Unknown. Combi's gonna charge up. It can't evolve this turn. I don't. I believe I still have uh, some time. So, Professor Birch. Oh, do you love decent shirt? He's got a decent shirt on. So, but Birch is like, no, your shirt is not decent enough. And Shaman's like, um, I don't like these guys. I don't have that much hit points. You gotta retreat me. So, Vespa Queen. Oh no, Battle Compressor. Are these Night March cards? We'll have to take a look because Night March are the right cards to put down. And if there's Night March, that means the Joltex could come out. Okay, so we'll see. Uh, we'll see what's up. And I think this last card is gonna be a nice trainer or a shaman, a nice supporter. He played Birch, so he can't play another supporter. I need a Sky Field. I really need a Sky Field. I really need Sycamore or any of my draw trainers, not Pokemon Fan Club. So, Vaporeon, this is an evolution deck. Okay, so I've got Swilus. And I've got no bench space. I can retreat my Shaman, but I'm just gonna have to hold out until I pull pull one of my critical critical cards. Give me a Skyfield is what I really want right now. Or otherwise I just have to take the hit. This is all I got, guys. I'm stuck, it happens. I'm, okay, she got my Shana's, got my Sycamores. Why? So we're both stuck. We're just passing each other's turn. Pass, pass, pass. Okay. All right. Passing. Your turn, my turn, your turn until finally Skyfield. So let's go ahead and throw out the cards. And now I can take momentum back. Let's go ahead and use that evil soda. And got to grab Hydreigon. He is now ready to go. In that case, I can uh, now use my escape rope. Pull out somebody. 
Who do you want? Your Vespa Queen. If you send out Vespa Queen, it's going to go out. But let's pull this out instead. And I'm going to attach an energy. I've used my... Oh, Lysander! Yes! So I will take that out. We're going to use Dark Impulse. That energy I had from the beginning. Got to go back onto Sharpedo. Man, once you get the right card, the momentum really picks up. Got to throw away one of these energies. That's the queen. All right. So, there we go. And now, just with one card, everything just spikes up and just goes my way. Sycamore. Ooh. So he's got Best for Queen Ace Trainer. I, I already have three cards. I'm just going to give you three cards that I didn't want. So I can like Xander again. This is good. So this combi is, is, is like the, the buy some time. He's here for a decoy. He's like, oh, I don't like my job. But here, I'll buy some time until the real threat comes. The real threat's right here, but we can deal with it. Lysander, you are the man, Lysander. So, Battle Compressor. He throws out Flareon, Vaporeons. This is... I'm not sure what he else is going to throw out. Eevees, Unknowns. I guess he wants the power. And Acrobite. Now, I remember doing the, one of these decks Friday, and you see his energy is not going, he's too slow on my deck. And you can probably see in one of the losses videos. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it, how my Best of Queen deck does. So, so definitely check that out. Shaman, okay. Shaman, four more cards. But can you charge your Pokemon up? Oh, Best of Queen's up. And if it's got double colors, it's going to hit my Sharpedo really hard. It's going to hit my Sharpedo really hard. But I don't think. You can't one-shot me. You can't one-shot me. Sharpedo's like, ah, no problem at all. But I really got to take this, get that Pokemon going. All right, 140. I was, see, he's like, I got this, guys. I'm going to get a Velto going. Zwilus is coming up. And let's go ahead and use the Burst Seeker. I need some more. Oh, my Xander. I'll keep one in my hand. Just let him know what's coming for him. I'm so mean. All right, so got to get that energy out. It's like. Here you go, Sharpedo. It's like, thank you. I'm going to use my Jagged Fang, take out this Vespa Queen. And he's going to give up. Okay. So, there we go. Done. And we'll be moving on to the next All match. Right, let's get some tournament match started. Hi, I'm using one of your decks. Huh. Well, it seems you've been watching my channel. And, oh, my God, this is the last video's deck. Oh, shoot. What am I supposed to say that? He's like, oh, well, I just said, well, I just said, oh my god, it's the last video's deck. Okay, so if that's the case, I'm screwed. Oh, well, we'll see what happens. So, Battle Compressor, no. This is a Night March Vespa Queen deck, guys. So the more, the more cards Pokemon this card, the stronger it becomes. And, let's see, there goes the defense. Okay, Combi. And now Pokemon Fan Club. Pokemon Fan Club is going to grab out two basic Pokemons. Definitely more Vespa Queens and maybe a Might March. Joltix. My whole deck a week against Lightning. Unknown. Okay. So luckily I'll be able to survive. So let's see if we can uh, do sort of a comeback. Now, okay, Pokemon Fan Club. I need Koopa. Please do not be prized. You're prized. Why? Why? Okay. Gonna take a Shaman instead and a Dino. And let's throw out Dino. Uh, I'm gonna have to throw out Pokemon Fan Club and one Hydreigon. And pull out, let's see, let's pull out Sharpedo. Sharpedo. Yes, I'll throw out Sharpedo. And then let's play out Shaman. Yep. Okay, it's gonna be Velto. And I get I can play Verse Seeker for another Pokemon Fan Club. Get me some more, or at least one more Shaman. And that's it. I'll end my turn. I'm just going to say Monday's video deck. Okay. And now he's going to evolve to Vespa Queen. That Joltik is ready to go. And Vespa Queen. Oh, dear. Battle comp another Battle Compressor. This means he can pretty much one and two shot my Pokemon. Especially that Joltik. And unfortunately, my Pokemon, none of my Pokemon are ready to go. So, we'll have to... We'll have to see what happens now. Okay. So, Vespa Queen, 100 damage, and okay. Who to send out? This is tough. I'll have to, I'll have to drop out Velto. I'll have to drop out Velto. 
I've got an energy, but he's not able to attack this turn. Let's go ahead and just use this. Grab a Pokemon fan club, and hopefully this Shaman will bring out something. I'm just only grab, well, one Shaman. One Shaman, nothing else. I could have grabbed something to completely fill my bench, but not yet. So, gonna grab two more cards. This is a dead, this is a dead hit. Ouch. Ouch. So, I will survive. No, he'll just retreat. He should retreat and use Jiltic. And there comes another Jiltic. My whole deck is weak against Lightning, and Jiltic is gonna come out. Sycamore, Sycamore. Fairies. Oh, this is my Friday's deck. And Battle Compressor. Not again. This is such good comboing in it. I'm, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. So, Zerneus. Joltek gonna come down, just retreat, and hit my Veltal, and that's it. That's all he's gotta do. Joltek, more than enough ready to take me out. So, going down, guys. Combi, his setup is just so awesome, and okay, more Joltek's. Fairies going down. Ultra Ball, this is gonna be another Vespa Queen. Or maybe a Shaman. I, used, I think I remember having a Shaman in that. Alright. Joltek, yep, coming out. 400 damage! No! No, I'll just, I'll just have to send out Sharpedo. And I'll just add an energy. We'll play Pokemon Fan Club. I'll grab you and another Sharpedo. So, drop you, Sharpedo, Shaman, and at this point, if I don't. I'm stuck. I'm stuck, guys. I'll just end my turn. I think this is it. This is it. Shiltic gonna one shot. Charpedo, there's not much me to do with this. Oh boy. 400 damage. And we'll have to send out the last Charpedo. I'm just gonna have to take this. Okay. I'll end my turn. That's it. That's it. I'm just gonna say GG. And that's it. 400 damage. <laughs> oh. You're still here? Well, welcome to uh, another serving of shark and chicken. Now, I'm gonna send out my shark and hopefully we'll get the chicken in a bit. All right, so it is gonna be Mega Sept... Oh, Septile, it's not Mega yet. But you know if they're Septile, this is obviously gonna be a Mega. And this hand, you know, I would rather have some bench Pokemons right now, so hopefully we can reshuffle to like a Dino or something. Or a Sycamore, that's not so great. So I'll have to end my turn. We'll have to sick more Lucy's nice, excellent cards, but that's just how it goes. So Sceptile, this it can put me asleep, which is bad. I really hope this is Tails. But if I go to sleep, I can still wake up. But Unseen Claw, it's gonna take me out really fast if the coin flip goes in his flavor. So 10 damage. I've got this energy, so he does a little bit to himself. And what is gonna happen? Oh man, I'm poisoned, I'm going to sleep. And let's see, just Stay awake, man. Stay awake. Oh, it did not stay awake. Don't worry. I've got this. Instead of playing Sycamore, I'm gonna play Shauna. And you know, I'm, I may be already gone at this stage. So, let's actually go ahead, put this down, and escape room. I want to protect my Sharpedo. And the, yeah, there we go. I'll end my turn, like, just like that. Now it does 60 damage, this thing only has 50 hit points, so I'm gonna go down. So Dino's like, I hate you, no, why'd you do this to me? Mega Sceptile's gonna come up, so he's not gonna, tr didn't have another energy. Okay, so, let's go ahead and do this. We'll play Shauna, I need some better cards. Oh, better cards, so. Let me look at my hand, I'm gonna discard this double drag energy. Dino is not gonna have a chance to go up. I'll discard this energy. Yes, for a what? I, I would rather have a Zwilus right now. No, no, I need a Dino. I need a Dino. Give me a Dino. There are no more Dinos? That's my only one? No! No! Um. Okay, plan B, guys. We gotta get Velto. We gotta get Velto out. We're gonna attach this energy, so now that if I get another escape rope, that'd be awesome. Looks like I got a Zwilus. Zwilus, what's your retreat cost? What's your retreat cost? I'll just go ahead and throw down Veltal. This, this really stinks. This really stinks. If I get another energy, awesome. If not, I'll just leave like that. So, I'll end my turn. 
he's gonna upgrade Weeping Bell. Does he have energy? Oh, with Sycamore, he's definitely gonna have an energy. For sure, for sure. Plant Stadium, gonna evolve into Weeping Bell, but this will tax his energies very much. So, let's see. It's level ball, another Bell Sprout going up. Does he have an energy? Does he have an energy? Do, do he? Trainer Mail, okay. Trainer Mail's gonna give him something that gets the energy. Nope, it's gonna get a Sycamore. First Seeker. Gotta get it to Sycamore, maybe an Ace Trader, perhaps? But I, if he had an energy, he'd definitely stick it on and attack me right now, but he doesn't. So, I'm good. In which case, I'm just gonna retreat my Dino. No, 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 no. Ultra Ball into a Shaman. Oh, he's got an energy. Goodbye, Dino. I'm sorry. You're just gonna have to draw the energy. Oh, unless you don't draw the energy. Another Weeping Bell gonna go up. All right, you got an energy. Two Weeping Bells. See weeping bells. They, you have to attach energy and discard it, but maybe he may not have enough. So that stadium has been pulling him a lot of weight, and I've got the energy I needed. I'm gonna go ahead and retreat my only Dino, and we're gonna send this out. This is how much does the retreat cost? Oh, so gonna evolve my Dino, and we're gonna start praying on his bench. Now I don't want him to use his ability. Let's just use that and buy me some time. I'm going to go and grab, pull out Victory Belt. 50 damage. Yeah, this, this is good. This is good. So, what you gonna do now? He's gonna use Battle Compressor. Throw away cards he doesn't need because he needs full energies. Hmm. Somebody's calling on this guy. Okay. You didn't hear that at all. Now, let's see. Let's see. Battle Compressor, what are you gonna throw? This is not a Night March deck. I'm, I'm a bit confused why... You would play Battle Compressor in this deck. You only see that in, like Vespa Queen Night March. When more cards in discard comes to more power, or more energies come to more power. So this isn't the right kind of deck. We'll see. Weeping Bells definitely don't need any more of those energies. I guess he has an energy retrieval or maybe mega turbos. But this deck is very energy expensive because you're always throwing energy away with Victory Bell, or it, throwing energies away with Jagged Saber. And Spirit Link, he doesn't even need that Sycamore Man going through this deck. Professor Slutter, gotta get the energies he needs, but he cannot use Wafting Scent, so I won't, I'll be good from Confusion. He's definitely gonna charge up this Mega Sceptile, though. Yep, nope. Gonna charge this up, Wafting Scent, yep. I have my Hex, whatever, thingamabobber out, so you can't, you can't take me out. Now, let's see. The confusion will really, really, really harm me though. So I really don't want to do, really, really would not, I rather have to deal with that. So there's a Sceptile, gonna charge this up. Okay. This may be my first prey, so I may actually try to take this out other than something else. All right, so now let's evolve Hydreigon and this will allow me to unlock my next ability. Do I want to buy some time or do I just want to take this victory bell out? Let me. I need some prize cards. Let's go ahead and use Dark Impulse. And we're going to grab one of those energies onto Sharpedo. I'm going to attack with this attack. This attack and discard one of these energies. Goodbye, Victory Bell. There goes one of them. And I'll take my prize card. It's one of my Dinos. Good, good. So hopefully I'll be able to get this up and running soon. I burned through a lot of my um, draw cards already. So this is a little bit bad. Now he has the choice who to send out. He can only attach one energy per turn. I think Mega Sceptile is going to be the right choice. So here comes Mega Sceptile. This will allow him to attack and attach an energy to Victory Bell. For sure. So attack Professor Birch. No, you have energies in your hand. Birch is... Let's see if Birch works. It Birch works. Seven more cards. There has to be energies in there. So he's going to grab a Sycamore. Trainer Mail again. Lys oh, Lysander. No, do not Lysander me out. No, he discarded one of my energies. A hundred damage. I've only got 50 left, but luckily he didn't pull Victory Bell's ability. It takes a little bit of damage, okay. So, you know what? All I can do is charge this up and we're gonna use Dark Impulse and just, just like nothing, he's ready back up, ready to go. Jagged Saber. 120 damage, and I'll just discard this, and he also discard that. Yeah. Now, Mega Turbo, no, he just countered that so perfectly. 
Yeah, <laughs> then Sharpedo is going to go out, but I think Veltal is going to take this. Nope. Just got another giant stadium up, but he's almost out of cards. What? You're going to deck out? You're going to deck out? One card left. One card left, and Sharpedo, he's going to take the bullet. But I see this, and maybe, maybe he didn't realize that, or maybe he has a Birch to reshuffle. All right, another Sceptile ready to go. This is not looking... He's got more momentum than me, but this, this, so, Sharpedo, he's like, okay, just get it over with, just get it over with, guys, he took out one Pokemon, and, oh, he's gonna retreat, he's gonna buy some time, yep, send out the healthier Sceptile, energy retrieval, and, oh, man, this is gonna completely heal off Mega Sceptile, Jacket Saber, 100 damage, one energy, or two energy is definitely coming down on you, healing you up. But you're going to draw your last card unless you have some way to reshuffle. 160 damage heal. Yep. And Veltal's going to come out. Uh, another energy to put on the confusion on my Pokemon. Alright. I need Lysander. I need Lysander. So, Veltal's the only other Pokemon choice I have. I'm going to discard a stadium. Yeah, let's discard a stadium and let's blow Sycamore. Fortunately, throw this away. Give me an energy. Alright, an energy. So, Veltal's going to come up. Let's throw away Pokemon Fan Clubs. I don't really need them anymore. And I'm going to grab my next evolution line. So Zwilus will be ready to go soon. Now let's put this uh, here. We'll use Hydreigon's Dark Impulse. And going to grab out Energy. So now I can attack. I'm going to throw you down. Yeah, give me more cards. I should actually play that. Uh, my Zwilus to evolve. So, slow down, Donald. And I think that's it, guys. We're going to use Evil Ball. Evil Ball, 140 damage. This thing is halfway gone. He drew his last prize card. And let's see if, uh, if he play, can reshuffle his hand. So now I'm poisoned, but I cannot go down. Gonna retreat by some time. 100 damage. <laughs> Look at that, no prize cards. So, Mega Sceptile deck, this is a pretty cool setup. But, I'm gonna end my turn. No cards there, and victory! <laughs> what a weird way to win, but oh, you made it to the end! Congratulations! So, I hope you enjoyed those matches, and if you left me a comment last Friday, I'm gonna answer them right now. Hashim Don, hey, you play League of Legends vid make videos? Mmm, computer's not strong enough. Maybe in the future. Saw some Pokemon TCO video, so you finally added birch once again he hee may the luck be with you don i know man i know tails Ugh. ha ha three stephen michael ha 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 three one fourteen whispers lysander i know man lysander wins games mike gotta say that edition of Zerneus is very original highly unexpected i'm sure a lot of favors would get confused thinking it's a fairy deck but instead awesome thank you mike it's a bit weird that it actually destroyed me in one of the matches now stupid love this <laughs> why would you name yourself that man you're not stupid who needs a jolteon for electric weakness once you have jolteon yeah one shine that mega red claw is a long black <laughs> why you guys come up with these names hey don i heard you mention league of legends you want to see league of legends video okay maybe next month because i'm getting that's when i'm gonna get my computer upgrade best queen day cheap and powerful all i can see is how surprised how you change your results? Yep, that Joltik. That little tiny Joltik took out Mayra Graza. But I had teammates. I think this is a good idea with this deck because my Pokemon are just dying left and right. Good idea. Red Jais instead of Reggie Eyes. Why is it not called Reggie? Man, yo, I got it. This is Luminarius in their Gear Tina match. In the description, he beat the heck out of me. Yep. Yep. Too sad. I'm not gonna even read the rest, but I got. I did, Michael. I did, Michael. Is Mew EX rotated? Yep. It is. And that's already been answered. My favorite part is the Kieran in the intro. The Kier? Kitch? Kit? Okay. Enough about that. And Saito Game is your name. You can't lose time with a deck like this. You have to attack every turn. But I want to be a little bit interesting and a little different so Xerneas did his job within two attacks I was ready to trade over and over and over so Xerneas hey it did his job and it beat the heck out of me this match oh so, I think I got everything so if you leave me a comment 
this video, I may answer it on Wednesday on Lucario. But what is actually coming tomorrow? Let me close out this um, window. Yep, there we go. Next is a guide I said would be coming out Wednesday, but I'm just going to, you know, spread the Pokemon videos out. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, just like how everybody else does. So, just a short guide and damn skills. You see what that is tomorrow and my usual deal. If you like Spotify, or of course you like Spotify. If you like my music, you can find it on Spotify, iTunes, SoundCloud. Or get it from my website for free. Hey, please do follow me on Twitter, Facebook. Like and subscribe. And if you're ready to subscribe, thank you very much. I love you, and I will see you tomorrow. We're a very short guy. Bye-bye, Anna Girls. Bye.